Aloha everyone, this is Max with Asian Geek Squad, and today I'm going to show you how to navigate your Samsung Galaxy Fit. Your Samsung Galaxy Fit will automatically wake up once you lift it. Or you can also tap the home button, and that will wake up your device as well. If you swipe left to right, it will show your notifications. Currently, I don't have any. If you swipe top down, these are your quick settings. So you have your brightness, do not disturb, water lock, find your phone, and nighttime. And when you swipe right to left, these are your widgets. Anytime you want to go back, just tap the home button. Now the home button, if you tap it and hold it, it gives you the option of a quick start workout. This you'll have to set up on the application. And if you hold it for a really long time, that'll give you the option of powering off the device. Now let's go ahead and customize this device. And the easiest way is to do it through the application. Now here we are with the Samsung Galaxy application. The first thing I want to go over are the watch faces. We have ones that are artistic, these separate ones that have big time, and these have the time, and as you can see on the bottom, they're a little bit different. So one has steps, one has heart rate, one has calories burned, the other one has temperature, there's one with analog, and here on the bottom, you have the digital ones. So if you like a lot of numbers, this one shows the time, calories, your heart rate, and the steps you've taken. And here we have the time in a large display, which will make it very easy to see. Next up, I suggest customizing your notification. You would just tap on the notification, manage notification, and turn on or off whichever notification you want to receive or don't want to receive on your smartphone. Next up, let's go over widgets. So these are the widgets that are available. Health summary, exercise, stress, sleep, weather. Those are the default. If you tap the red line on the left, that will remove it. And you can also add additional widgets. Caffeine intake, calendar, calories, heart rate, steps, stopwatch and timer, and also water. If you want to prolong the battery life, go ahead and tap on display. From here, you can change the brightness and you can also change the screen timeout. The screen timeout, it could be as short as seven seconds, which is the default, or you can make it as long as five minutes if you want the watch on for a long period of time. I'm gonna go ahead and change mine to 15 seconds. Now, as we said earlier, you can press and hold the side key, which I've been calling the home key, and here, it automatically defaults to running. If you tap this, you can select any other workout. So if you hold the button on the left, this workout will automatically turn on. All right, so we've just covered navigating and customizing your Samsung Galaxy Fit. If you guys have any questions, leave us a comment down below. Thank you guys for watching. Aloha.